I think I learned from um, making mistakes. Um, eventually, I get things right, and then that's experience, and then you know better the next time. But I also think it's really important to do something that you've never done before. So you don't really understand what it is you've learned until you've done it, and then you realise that it, it's a new thing. So there have been lots of different processes that have been understood and seen through to the end. And you learn by, by looking, by observation, obviously, but I think by doing. Um, and what's really important is the impulse to start something, and it doesn't really matter what, what, what it is that you do, but you must or I must, when I, when I want to start a piece of work, I just kind of start anywhere. And then it, it leads on to a series of steps that evolve into a finished piece of work. But I never know what it is that I'm going to make before I've started. I can talk about the work on the roof, actually, which is called Riptide, because I have never in my life considered using polystyrene in a piece of work. And it wasn't the original choice for the spheres which, were, which are attached to the rebar. Originally, and I had these made um, about f uh, 30 acrylic spheres that were sprayed in the colors of the Delawar Pavilion. So there was a lovely blue, a dark orange, and a yellow, but actually they didn't work. They were too light and they put too much, too much pressure was put on them. So I just had this polystyrene sphere in the studio and, uh, and then I, it was actually the day that all the spheres went off to come here. And I thought, oh my God, this is, this is not gonna work. Quickly rethink, and I had one of these quite frightening, but also not frightening, ter sort of terrifying, but also very exciting moments of suddenly, I've got to, I've got to read it, I've got to make a, a change, what can I do? And I thought, well, actually, it could be, poly they could be polystyrene, which is solid, and there must be a way of painting them so they're completely impervious, waterproof, which there is. And Within two days, I kind of solved that complete problem and they work, they work perfectly.